Alright guys, how's it going? This is James here and I'm back with another benchmarking video and this one is on The Witcher 3. Now, The Witcher 3 just came out not too long ago and so far it's one of my favorite RPG games. Now I'm going to be running this on all settings on 1080p from low to high to ultra and if you don't know the rig that I'm running this on, it's an ASUS GL551JW gaming notebook, packs an Intel Core i7-4710HQ and a GeForce GTX 860M with 16GB of RAM. Now, if you have a system similar to this, and after the benchmarks, you see that it might not run that well on your system or you're not happy with it, at the end of the video, I will give you my personal configuration on what I run the game on, so you're not losing a lot of eye candy. You're still running it on high, basically, and it still looks good, and you're not getting any stuttering or hiccups or anything like that. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into The Witcher 3. <laughs>
Alright guys, here are my recommended settings to run The Witcher 3 without a problem. If you're going over into your post processing tab, make sure that depth of field is off. Sharpening can either be on medium or high, I haven't seen any problems with that arising so you can go ahead and leave that there. And make sure ambient occlusion is on SSAO. Again I haven't experimented with any settings past this, but just to be on the safe side, let's keep it there. If you hop over into your graphics, make sure that VSync is on and your maximum frames per second is at 30. This will make sure the GPU does not render any extra frames that it does not need and keep the GPU temperature lower than what it would be if you had it on unlimited. Make sure your resolution is 1600 by 900. I know you want to play the game at 1080p, but with anti aliasing enabled and 1600 by 900, you're really not going to notice a difference and everything's basically going to be on high but you'll be able to enjoy it at a constant 30 fps without any dips or anything like that your display mode needs to be on full screen because windowed mode or windowed full screen can cause some problems and some frame drops nvidia hair works must be off you can't have it on for Geralt or anything else because this thing just destroys gpu frame rates all right your number of background characters can either be on low or medium but i keep mine on medium and foliage visibility range, I keep mine on medium because I don't really notice the grass being rendered as I'm moving if it's on medium. On low, I do notice that it does kind of irk me, but just keep it on medium and you guys will be good to go. Make sure hardware cursor is also off and basically everything else is on high settings and you're running it without a hitch. So enjoy this clip of me playing this um, on my settings, as you notice. Um, it runs just as well as low, but you know. If these settings help you, make sure to leave a comment down below. Let me know they helped, and also leave a thumbs up. If you have any other recommended system, you know, settings, leave those also in the comment section down below. And subscribe for more content, guys. I will see you guys in the next one.